What's going on, guys? Jones and Dogs here. Yeah. Bye, 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 bye. Welcome back to the channel. <laughs> All right, guys. I got this little guy out with me. Now, you guys know, usually, typically, I do an unboxing in my studio in an RC cave. Usually, it goes down in the RC cave, but this, this guy, this little box right here, this little box, so so small it didn't come with a lot so i just figured we go ahead and unbox it here really quickly and go ahead and fly this guy i've already pre-charged it and we're gonna go ahead and go for a fly with this little sh10 it's kind of breezy out here man so hope to, hopefully this little thing don't fly away on me hopefully it don't fingers crossed fingers crossed fingers crossed guys everybody cross your fingers hopefully it don't fly away the sh10 by shrc hobby this is another one of the goodies that was sent over from uh, TDR drones, e-bikes, and scooters by my boy B, my boy Brian over there, man. That's my brother over there, man. Make sure y'all go over there, check him out. Uh, of course, I will drop a link to his channel in the description below. So you guys go check out B, man. And if you do go check him out, man, make sure you guys tell him that drones and dogs sent you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so check him out. TDR, TDR drones, e-bikes, and scooters, man. Sent this, sent this over for us to take a look at. So I'm excited to take a look at this little guy. Like I said, hopefully, now something like this is pr primarily an indoor flyer, you guys, honestly. But hey, I wanted to give it. Here's all the contents out of the box, you guys. Looks like you got a couple of instruction manuals here. You know, one with the quick guide for the app and uh, one instruction manual in Chinese and one instruction manual in uh, English. You have your charger there, of course. A little pin charger that comes with a lot of these little micro drones and then we have this little thing here man check that little boy out Ch -ch -ch -ch. look at that control there none of the buttons are labeled but we'll get it figured out man i kind of briefly went over the instructions for a little bit takes two AAA batteries in the back see that they are two AAA batteries um i do know by looking at the instructions and get that out there that, um, pressing in on this stick pressing in on this will activate the flip so you can you can press in on it and then press the direction and it'll flip in that direction then pressing in on this joystick will act activate the speeds or what we call rates so you got three rates low medium and high rates and then you got your traditional trim buttons and all that stuff and then you got up here you got like headless mode and uh one key return something like that i gotta look at the instruction manual i can't really remember to be honest but uh we have to get it figured out uh yeah so you got one key return right here you got headless mode on this button up here then you got your fpv foam out here i'm doing this with one hand you guys so get bear with me got your fpv foam mount with the on and off switch right there there's the on and off switch to the transmitter the fpv foam out there where you replace your phone and like i said this guy takes two triple a batteries and then we had to get this little sh10 out there it is there guys a little small you guys small thing and it has a charging port on it a little tiny little dude <laughs> a little tiny little it's a little baby check him out but it has an on and off switch there on the side you guys you can see there it has a small little camera up there i'm gonna guess it's a little 480 camera i can't imagine that being nothing too much more than that it might be 720p the SHRC hobby. I do like the uh, little paint splash on it of the blue with the white body. And I said, there's a little uh, transmitter, I mean, a antenna for the Wi Fi out the bottom there. And that's pretty much it, you guys. So we're going to get set to fly this guy and get connected to the app. The app for this guy is the SHRC. Um, looking at the instructions really quickly. The app is the SHRC GT app for this guy. So let me get that downloaded and we'll get ready to fly. Let's do it. Also, really quickly, guys, one more thing I forgot to mention. You get a set of uh, extra propellers, of course, and a Phillips screwdriver with this guy should you need to uh, fix or change any blades or anything like that, all right? So I forgot to mention that. I thought I would uh, throw that in there, too. So We are back. So I got the little SH10 turned on. You see the lights flashing there. I'm gonna turn on the remote control. I'm gonna do up, down on the throttle stick. You heard it beep twice. That lets us know that we're bound to the drone. So I'm gonna do also both joysticks down into the lower left corners. 
and the light should flash. And they did, they flashed. That's a level calibration there. And now we need to connect to the Wi-Fi of this little doohickey here. SHRC 13, okay, remember that. So that's the Wi-Fi. So once you connect to the Wi-Fi signal that the drone is emitting out, you wanna go ahead and connect to the app. It's the SHRC GT app. All right, guys, we're gonna connect that. So, all right, and we have FPV feed, you guys. Here we go. FPV feed, all right, that's pretty cool. So I look like I have some joysticks up here. I'm trying to see if I can, I got the sun glaring. See if I can get them joysticks up off my, um, my screen there. I can't really see it though to get them up off of there, but hey, that's neither here nor there. So we're just gonna go ahead and start the recording. Recording started, timer counting down. All right guys, so let's see if we should be able to, both joysticks down and out, starts the motors and throttle up. <laughs> okay. All right, so it has altitude hold and that's the altitude hold there, holding it. It's, it's a little guy, so it is gonna just blow up with any little bit of wind. It's gonna blow with the altitude hold. It's, it is holding it though, so it's holding it. Check it out, that's a little thing, man. Little guy. So here's our fourth flight. Got a little pep to it. Fourth flight in the first rate. Coming on past for a flight. There's our yaw, first rate. Okay. Let's go ahead and increase the rates by pressing in on the left joystick. Two beeps. This is the second rate. There's our yaw in the second rate, and it did increase, you can tell. Now let's check out the fourth flight. <laughs> this is pretty cool little thing man this thing is like a little dot flying so this is the forward flight in the second right here i hope you guys can see it man this thing is so tiny so i'm trying to keep it close because this thing is so tiny all right let's go for the third speed all right this is the third speed here there's our yard rate in the third speed the highest rate and here's our forward flight Try not to get blinded by the sun, because if I get blinded by the sun, I'm gonna lose this little thing. That's how small it is. Honestly. This thing is tiny. Yeah. You know, I'm I'm not even looking at my FPV feed because this thing is so tiny, I don't want to take my eyes off of it, guys. FPV feed is still going though. Recording is still going, so we're good there. What? Look at that little tight little flip. Did you guys even see it? Flip? Look at that. Oh my God. Yes. Nice. <laughs> oh, this thing is tight. B, I like this, man. Brian, if you're watching this, man, this little thing is tight, man. I like this little joker. It does have some LEDs underneath. I'm not sure if you guys can see them here in the daytime, but I can see them. It got blue LEDs in the front and it has red in the rear. So I definitely will be night flying this little tiny little thing. Oh my God. This thing is so tiny, you guys. This is this is so tiny, a little nano little camera drone. That is so cool. So we got we're coming up on about three and a half minutes of recording. Just about. So that's pretty good. So we know we know we're gonna hit at least four minutes of flight time with this little thing. And I can't imagine. The, the, the size of the battery in that little thing with this having a camera it has to have a little tiny little battery on it yeah it's not flipping anymore so let me stop the recording so we, we save that bring this little guy in Ooh, oh i thought it was auto landing for a second are we flashing yep lights are flashing and it's let's get on it over here lights are flashing so we do need to bring it down I'm not even sure what the uh, land button is, but check it out. The little SH-10, this little thing flies great. 
little quick little flight time but that's to be expected with it being so tiny as to have a short little flight time let's see if we can go ahead and bring it down i'm just going to throttle down because i'm not even sure what the land button is or if there even is a land button because i didn't read the instructions like oop, i just throttle down for too long and it just dropped down that wasn't the drone that was me pressing down throttle and it, the motors killed <laughs> but yeah this thing is not too bad man i like that little thing this is the sh 10 by shrc hobby I want to thank my boy tdr drones e-bikes and scooters for sending this over absolutely a cool little flyer i would definitely be popping out with a night flight and a follow-up flight for you guys to check this thing out again hopefully the camera was pretty decent i didn't have enough time to take any photos or nothing like that so i'll definitely follow up if you guys want to see some photos the photos that take leave me a comment below and i'll definitely do that for you guys but i'm your boy drone and dogs until next time thanks for watching guys i'm out Doses.